Guys, in this video, we're going to be taking the world's biggest RC car and jumping it off the world's biggest jump. And I know what you're saying. You're saying, but Kev, the Raminator's bigger. And I suppose, yeah, it is bigger, but this has got a bigger body. Man, look at the size of these beasts. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise, size matters. And these babies know exactly what to do with it. You're saying, Kev, that's not the world's biggest jump. Well, hardcore RC jumped his RC car off a bit, 50 foot Jesus. high in the air, which is the highest that I know of that any RC car has ever gone in the whole world. Oh Jesus. Oh my God. 49 feet. Oh. Bum, bum, bum. I'm not having that. So this giant tar seeker has a petrol engine, so for good measure, we're gonna chuck in a giant electric one too. But before we kill him by sending him to the moon, let's first hit the racetrack. And then after that, we're going to the moon. <laughs> Hopefully we won't break it because the car and the parts are really expensive. And by the way, if you wanna know where we can get these cars from, there's gonna be a link to all of that down below. I wanna take the Raminator along with us too. Trouble is, Andy Delandy's broken. Claire and Ian are gonna come and pick me up, but we gotta get all the toys into one car so I can only really bring what we've got space for. That joint in there is just about to fall to pieces. 100 mile an hour, this thing comes off and oh my God, that would be bad. Comment down below if you know what happens if this falls off. So with two stroke engines, you've got to get the mix right and I think it's supposed to be 20 to one. I've got no way of mixing it apart from this thing that's leaking. So we've got that much fuel in there and then I put about that much of oil in there. Hopefully it's going to be all right. If not, bye bye low C engine. Low C, low C, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. Hopefully that lot's going to fit in there. I don't think Raminator is gonna fit. Oh look, we got Ian and Claire in the house. I think Raminate is too long. Oh, that's full. That'll go in there, that's about it. Yeah, they ain't going off. <laughs> Where's the Raminate going? On top of everything. <laughs> oh look, postman's just come. We'll have a little look to see what's in here a little bit later. Here we are on location. We got the victims. Here's everyone else's victims. Can't wait to see that one go to the moon. <laughs> <laughs> is it going to the moon? It will do. Oh yes. It's supple. Nah, they're not supple. Nah. So we're gonna start off with the lossy. It's a little bit bigger than everybody else, so they're probably gonna think I'm being a bully. Let's see if it works. Maxes. Let's see if we can win the race. Space time. DBXL, we've got X Maxes, we've got Quay and EXPs. What's that little so car? That's the rabbit, we've got to chase the rabbit. Everyone ready? Oh, no, we're at the 
end now. Can we catch up? Can we catch up? We got to catch up. We got X Maxes in front. Oh! <laughs> How did we recover out of that? We're in second. Somehow we've made second. And we're first. We're in the lead. How? How are we in the lead? No, you're not. There we go. We got it. Who's the daddy? He said his arms started out. Uh, oh. oh, and the hell! How did he land it? Oh, he's broken it. I mean, I sort of we done, mate. Oh, who's fixing it? Yeah, he's getting it now. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, mate, I'm running out of film. Oh, Martin's got to send it to the moon. Get him over, baby. Oh, no, has Martin got your car? I'm a tough baby. Oh, tough. Right in breaking the kids' toys. <laughs> oh my god! Jesus! Here we go for the high jump record. Is that going for the roof? Oh, he's wrenching. What height are we going with? 50. Yeah. 50 foot. Dad's wrenching away. Getting that ESC back in there. Look at the size of that motor. That's fist size. Right, DBXL's getting it. Oh, I don't want to kill anything today. Oh, he is going to the moon. Oh! Oh! Finish it! <laughs> oh! Nasty! Go to the moon! DBXL to the moon! <laughs> What's the old chassis looking like? Oh, we're looking good. Claire, how's the hunger situation? I'm starving, Kev. <laughs> oh, I'm not doing anything. Oh, yeah, right. The wrong tyres on it. Dave, are you filming this? Well, <laughs> Did you kill it or is it all right? What happened to it? It went pulling out, was it? Oh no. <laughs> I, I was full throttle, but it was all. The mesh was really tight on it. Sounded like it was frictioning, didn't it? What yeah. happened? What happened? Oh yeah. No, it's probably just a shaft rubbing. Tumble. Just send it again. <laughs> you can take it out of the wheel as well, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here comes next Max. Here comes a. Oh! That was up there. Take no tough, baby. That's taking it all right, that is. Put it. It's going to hit that flat out and go to the moon. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> 
Ah. Next time, subscribe and hit the bell. Start it up, come on. <laughs> Go on then, start it up then. Look at Martin. Martin just wants to see it in pieces. You're out of order. To the <laughs> What's the old chassis straightness looking like? Oh! It's alright. Is that supposed to be like that? That's right, we've got a hammer. Guess what guys, I've broken nothing all day. Nothing's broken. Actually, we did break them. And in a minute, we're gonna have a little look to see what's inside these parcels. So on this one, all that we broke was the ESC mount. And on this one, we actually broke the front bulkhead. If you look here, look, it's ripped the screw out. This plate here is supposed to be butted up to that. And that's what allowed the chassis to bend across here. These are like 300 pounds or $300. So we're just gonna hammer it straight and fit a new bulkhead. Parcel time! It's Christmas. Christmas every day. So we got a load of new tires. Oh, we got a new bulkhead for the lossy body clips. And guys, I've been waiting for this for ages. It's a Chevy C10 body to fit onto one of these little mini monster trucks. I'm going to be building a new one soon. We're going to 3D print a load of parts, and I want it to look like what my real monster truck's going to look like. We're going to put the same body on it. Oh, this is for a friend of mine because he sees Stempy nail my one flat out. So now he wants one because it took the punishment. Oh, and we got a vortex because you guys in the comments said you wanted me to get one. It's supposed to do 60 mile an hour out of the box. So we're going to see if it actually does. And then we're going to also send it to the moon. Postman. It's Christmas every day. Check it out, guys. These are skins. They go into the bottom of your RC car. <laughs> guys, these are epic. So we got some for the infraction. Guys, that looks epic. And it protects your chassis as well. This one's for the Creighton EXB. And a whole load more for different cars as well. So a massive thanks to armorskins.com for sending me these. Check them out, guys. They've got loads of different designs for loads of different cars. Not just armors, other cars as well. If you click on one of these videos here, I will see you over there in a minute. <laughs> 